Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, as you can tell by the title and the thumbnail, I am starting a new series on this channel, which is the iCraft SMP. Yes, guys. As you guys know, I used to be part of two SMPs before, and they kind of all both broke apart because of inactivity, I guess, by other members, and um, it was just too hard to get them back together. So I kind of quit on the SMP thing, and I never really wanted to go back to an SMP server. And um, throughout that time, I kept on getting invites and invites from all different SMPs, which with channels around my size and lower. And um, a couple of days ago was it I can't remember what day really I'd have to check my YouTube private messages but a couple of days ago I have um, had a private message from Luke Zilla the owner of this SMP and he was like dude your channel is amazing your content is amazing do you want to join an SMP and I was a bit afraid because um, I've been getting a lot of invites like by people where they're just inviting people because their SMP is kind of dying, if you know what I mean, to just to get more people, get more, like, you know, people watch their, their SMP series and stuff and their server, and, um, you know, but, um, this server is amazing, it's amazing, this, everyone's so active, so thank you very, very much, LukeZilla, for inviting me to this SMP, and by the way, if you are wondering where to find these people, like, all the members of the server will be down in the description below if you want to go and give a... Um, check their channel world and everything else, but you're probably wondering where the hell are you? How do you get iron tools straight away? Are you cheating? <laughs> cheating? Cheating? Well, this is an iron farm. By the way, this is spawn chunks. It's the center of spawn chunks. This is spawn chunk. This is where everyone spawns when they get into the server. This is where I spawned, and as soon as I uh, got whitelisted to the server when I straight came from college a couple or like an hour ago, I guess, um, I had um, another member called Linz. Uh, give me a little tour, you know, where to get food and stuff, and she also took me to her base, so she gave me a saddle and uh, a diamond block, and also uh, supplied me with some armor from her mob farm, or she said, you know, if you need anything, just take it, I was like, uh, these some, some mob drops, you know, some golden armor, just put all these golden armors together in the crafting thing here, and then I just got a full set of golden armor, because it's better than nothing, I guess, you know, and then I'd gone to the automatic chicken farm, which is in the, um, uh, what's it called the um, iCraft spawn town which is through the portal I'll show you later on in the video but this is spawn chunks this is where the iron farm is it's not like the craziest iron farm it's just a regular iron farm but it creates a large amount of iron it's it's a good amount of iron because it's here in the spawn chunks always loaded you know always works and also it's on the 24 7 server so it works 24 7 so it's pretty good it's great we've got free iron free poppies if we need red dyed armor or anything maybe it could this could be useful no my, my favorite color is green and won't be useful for anything to be honest but um yeah um I'm, I'm still new to the server i kind of joined in a couple of like an hour ago ish somewhere around now and in today's video um i'll just be like gathering resources getting some stuff and also that diamond block you know what there's an ender chest let's put diamond block in the ender chest and put every like Anything important in the ender chest? I think that's all it. That's everything which is important. Let's put some food in the ender chest. Just in case we're like somewhere and we're out of food but we got an ender chest on us. Okay. So this is how we're going to do it. I'm going to do a big time lapse of me gathering some... F uh, I was about to say some food but we've got plenty unlimited amount of food and iron. So I'm going to be gathering some wood. As you can see there's a big forest behind here. I don't think anyone will mind me digging some trees out here because it is a spawn chance if everyone, anyone wants to build a gigantic iron farm I guess. Um, they'll still have to get rid of the trees. So I'll go into the trees area, get some wood as a time lapse. So it's good that we got iron straight away. And also, I'll probably get some stone and try going mining into a uh, one of the, maybe the community mine mine thing in the spawn town when I'll show you the spawn town around a little bit but I'm blabbling on and everything let me just um, go do the big time lapse you know gather some materials and then we will worry about other things after the time lapse
So guys, I've finally finished mining, and, and as you can see, this is actually the centre of the uh, spawn town, or the spawn village. I'll show you around in a little second. I don't really know where anything is, so uh, it's going to be a really bad tour, but I have gathered a lot of um, resources. Maybe not a lot, because these tools, these iron tools aren't the, the greatest, but let me have a look. So, in the ender chest, uh, we got loads of wood, four stacks of dark oak wood. That's pretty good for just a regular, say, um, iron pick, you know, a regular iron pick. That's pretty good, pretty good, pretty fast. Um, also, we got some uh, saplings, and also from the mining, I've got five stacks of uh, cobblestone. I just realized it's a community chest where you can get cobblestone for free, so I don't really need to go mining down here. By the way, this is where the mine is. Pretty, pretty sneaky, right? <laughs> If Linz didn't give me a tour around here, I wouldn't even know that there was a mine behind this map. But this map looks amazing. Loads of greenery. That's what I like. Um, I don't think the map updates. I think you have to take it off and then go explore the area and then come back. I don't know. I think that's how it works. I don't know. But, um, yeah, there's a community chest here. Okay, we're going to get some more cobblestone later on from here. Or maybe mining. But, yeah, we got five stacks of cobblestone. A bit of uh, these side stone blocks like granite andesite diorite two dirt <laughs> two dirt's pretty funny uh, i don't really need any dirt we've got some redstone i'm gonna actually put the redstone here even though i'm not gonna use it and some redstone torches which i created because i didn't have regular torches but then i replaced it with regular torches um to put that there um also some gold we got five we found some gold and some coal which is pretty pretty useful you know coal i, I didn't have any coal when i started went mining so i was like Oh no, no coal, that's pretty bad. So um, this is what we did today. So now, um, I like this. I like this. I like this area. I like this SMP. Everyone's really, really nice and friendly. And uh, now let's gather, I mean gather, let's walk around the spawn towns. Is this like the center? This is the end up end portal. Is this end? This is not an ender portal. This is um, a nether portal. It's like where you can enchant. I think level 30s are up to here. Yeah, up to level 30. That's pretty awesome. Don't need to uh, worry about enchanting, so I'll be enchanting very, very soon. But um, this is kind of like the center, like the main headquarters, and then everyone like just goes uh, out, um, I think. Yeah, this is the area where I got my food. The frames do suffer a little bit when I get here. As you can see, especially when I'm recording, goes down to like 50. This is really bad. This is where I get all the food, you know. A lot of animals around this area, so uh, I just don't have, we just can't be looking in this area. Look, my frames are dropping so bad. I'm not even gonna be in this side of the thing. So this is kind of like the, um, I don't know, industry area. There's like a redstone consult consultancy or something like that by Virus. So uh, make sure to check him out. He's a cool redstone dude. He does a lot of redstone and there's pretty cool redstone thing and a lot of redstone stuff. Do you buy redstone stuff over here? Oh. Oh. Oh, cool. That's pretty cool. And then you can ask. Oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. That's pretty cool. <laughs> I might I might donate some redstone for some diamonds maybe in return. Maybe half price. The, 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 I don't know. Um, yeah, this is pretty awesome. Everyone's a really good builder. Everyone's really active on the server. I'm really happy. I'm sorry, guys. Oh, I'm getting some lags around here. It's because of all the farms. I'm loading new areas up, new chunks up, which... Okay, there we go. That's where I don't get any lag. Let's go back into the center. 
So, this is like an awesome, very awesome service. So, um, I think you should go and check out everybody else. Every, I mean, yeah, everybody which is part of the server. Uh, the link will be down, all the links, all the links to everybody's, um, uh, channels are going to be down in the description below, but it's pretty awesome. And also, I just want to say a big sorry, guys, that I'm not doing any much than this what I did already uh, for this episode one well, this is more of a like a get to know each other episode and um, hopefully I can upload it straight away after I record it edit it you know and there we go we got some boost and stuff oh that's a nice house oh these houses are amazing I need to get some inspiration from these people these people are amazing these are shops right or these are houses I don't know uh, dig shop holes oh Oh, that's pretty cool. But you, I think he keeps all the ores. Yes, um, I think uh, this. Yeah, it's a pretty cool, pretty cool. Oh, there's a chest there. Pretty awesome. Okay, and apparently the houses of everyone's are like on the outskirts over here. I think down there, maybe some bases. Yeah, on the outskirts of the town itself, like you know, at the sides, uh, like a little. This is like a big commercial area in the middle where he's spawning, but then later on, the further on, there are like houses. And then, if I want to, I can go and build myself a base. But we are going to start over here, but not in today's video because unfortunately, I have run out of time, guys. Um, I have just came back from college and I was like, yay, I really need to record on here. My first episode, I'll upload this out of schedule, so a, hopefully, this is going to be up on today, which is Tuesday today. Hopefully, um, I've been recording for the for like what well, like two hours now so um yeah i'll quickly put that all together see how it go you know put everything together edit it and uh, i'm super excited i've got some projects planned for tea here um and um i'll be trying to arrange like a day where i upload it like it's a scheduled day so like my survival let's play is on mondays and then maybe this might be on fridays i don't know but um if i do upload it today on tuesday i will be live streaming on tuesday or the day i upload it i should be live streaming because now i'm gonna have two weeks off of um, college, I mean one week and a half actually to be exact or slightly more than a half but um, yeah um, I'm blabbling on and I kind of gotta go um, get myself you know revising for the next exam um, by the way I have exams every week so um, yeah but I'll talk to you guys in the live stream or maybe in the next video but I'm getting some serious lags over here because that's where the chicken and all the farms are there I'm never gonna go there except if I need food but um, yeah thank you very very much for watching hope you enjoyed it if you did, please make sure to leave a like. If you really, really love it, please make sure to subscribe. But, um, yeah, thank you very, very much for watching. Hope you're excited for the new series. Take care, everybody, and bye-bye.